Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today we have some really fun packages to open up. So let's get started. All right, so I have three packages here today. One of them is Funko and the other two are not. So we're gonna probably start with the ones that aren't Funko because I'm pretty excited about these. Actually, one of these packages here, I'm actually gonna show you guys and then I'm gonna apologize to you twos. I've had this here for probably, I think it actually said on here. Yeah, it says December of 2019. So you two, sorry about not opening this up quicker. I know it's been like seven months now, um, but I am really excited to see which ones are in here because it's been so long. I don't know if I remember anymore. And if you guys are wondering, they had sent these over for me to check out the YouTubes. I don't know if I had to make a video on them, but they did send them over. So I wanted to open them up in a video for sure, just so you guys could see what these look like. Cause all I've ever shown off on the channel, I think is Arthur. All right guys, so here we are. As soon as we cut the tape, let's see what we got on top. We have a letter here. Let's see what it says. Tristan, excited to hear your thoughts on YouTube. Please find Quackity and Mini Lad enclosed. You twos. All right, you twos. Thank you so much. I know we're a little bit late, um, but thank you so much for sending this over. So, I guess let's start with Quackity here. Yeah, let's start with this one here. Ooh, nice. Okay, so like I had said, I've only ever seen the Arthur one in person, so it'll be exciting to see what these ones look like. And I know for a fact, guys, these are not on YouTube's website anymore, but they still look really great. All right, guys, so here is the front of Quackity right there, and these do come with sleeves on them, so let's actually slide this up and see what he looks like. Ooh, it's just so fitting that he's sitting on a duck and I think that really does add a lot to the character. It just looks so good. And I really like that he's got all the rubber ducks in the background and he's got like almost like a desert around him. And it says, guys, please buy this toy. I'm on the verge of being homeless. I don't know what's going on. I really need the money. Oh God, please guys, please. This is really funny actually. This is one of the first U2s if I'm not mistaken. Like it's number 16, so very early on. So let me pop this thing out and see what it looks like out of the box. This is funny because the actual rubber duck seems very much like a, uh, like almost like one of those ones you have in a bath. Of course it feels better than that but it looks like one it also has u2s on the bottom it says u2s.com if you guys want to go check them out what i really like about these figures is that normally they're on the bottom of the feet but because he's sitting on the duck you can actually see they put it on his feet anyways and i think it's a really cool addition to the character how they do that um but yeah this is really really well done i'm a huge fan of this one all right guys now after quackity we did have mini lad here now there are a couple different versions of mini lad and i think if i'm not mistaken they're all sold out i'm not too sure but let's see what this one looks like here Okay, here we go. This one's really well done. It also has this mini lad logo in the background there, the big M. And then this one says, can someone let me out of this box? It's cold in here. Okay, this is funny. I like how they're all like uh, self-aware of the figure. Well, the first one was just him wanting to sell them, but this one's still really funny. So let's check this one out here, guys. Oh, and it also says on the inside, guys, smells like a meme stream day to me. So that's funny. They also put like little like hidden messages all over the boxes. I think these are really, really well done. And I'm excited to see what Craig looks like. I mean, of course we saw him in the box, but I want to see what he looks like out of the box. Oh yeah, this is really well done. I like the small details they gave him, especially with the beard, as well as the Mini Lad logo on his shirt. Um, he's got really detailed shoes as well. I also like how they do so much detail on this entire character. The shoes are really well done as well. Um, I know I've seen people wearing similar shoes to like Vans as well as Gucci slides. I think they look really great. But you guys can see they're there is Mini Lad. Now guys, I want to check something with these. So if I'm not mistaken, the original ones or the earlier ones used to be a little bit smaller than the new ones. So I actually grabbed my Arthur so we could check that out and see if that's true. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Arthur looks a little bit bigger, but I still want to check it. All right guys, so here is Arthur out of the box. Let's see how much taller he really is. Oh yeah, it's not that much taller. He's slightly taller. Um, I think it's mostly the ears, but then again, Quackity's a little bit taller, but I think most of them were the same height as Mini Lad here, which is just a little bit shorter, but it's still, all of these look really great. Anyways, you twos, thank you so much for sending these over and sorry it's seven months late. <laughs> All right guys, next up I wanna do this package right here. So this is uh, something that I was really excited about ordering. I've been wanting to order one of these for a while and every time I go to check to see if they're in stock, they're out of stock. There's a bunch of different colorways for this and I got a pretty good one here I think. I think this is probably one of my favorite ones they've done so far. I think, well you guys will see in a second what I'm talking about. I don't wanna cut too deep just in case I cut the actual figures box here. But uh, yeah, let's see what this thing looks like. So I think this will be my second time opening these up on the channel. I've done one other video on them in the past and I was really excited about getting those ones. They were actually nice enough to send them over. You guys might know what I'm talking about. Uh, but anyways, let's take this out here, guys. So this is another super plastic character that I'd ordered, and this is one of the Crankies. Now, if you guys don't know what Crankies are, you can probably see it through the tissue paper here, but it's one of these right here. So Cranky is a little bit different than the one I ordered last time. I think I got a Janky last time, if I'm not mistaken. And this right here is really, really cool. So this is supposed to look like a spray paint can. And just looking at the box here, guys, I love how bright and colorful this thing is. You guys can see it says super plastic on the side, and then on 
the other side, you guys can see it's got the cranky there. There's the front and there's the back. And I like how the front and back of the box have the front and back of the actual character. Now this is from 2020 and this is the pineapple yellow. And you guys might know which other one I was talking about. It was the Toronto red because I am from Canada. I think it would be really cool to get that one eventually. Just the problem is, is that it's sold out. So it's probably gonna be pretty expensive to get. And if you guys wanted this one, this one is also sold out. This is the pineapple yellow, like I had said, but they do put up these every once in a while. There's been, I think, a uh, purple, I think a pink, a red, a blue, perhaps. I don't remember. But anyways, they do have a couple colors of these and it seems like they do in maybe like every three to four months. I'm not too sure, but I'm sure there'll be another colorway coming soon. All right guys, so I'm popping this thing open here. Let's see. It says right on the flap there, janky says relax. This is really cool. So let's see what this guy looks like. This is my first time ever seeing one of these in person and I'm excited. Ooh. Oh, I forgot there's stickers in here. Yes. Okay, cool. So we got some extra stickers as well. There's just one. Yeah, good. One sticker. So you guys can see actually he, put that off the side so you guys don't, uh, you know, see it early. So you guys can see this is one of the different figures that they have in the same uh, style as the janky. And then you guys can see on this side, it says hashtag janky. All right, guys. So let's check this thing out and see what this thing looks like. So this is really exciting because if I'm not mistaken, it also shakes like a real spray paint can. I'm not too sure about that, but let's check it. Okay, here we go, guys. Oh, hold on. The lid also comes off as well. I forgot about that, but let's do it. Here we go. You ready? <laughs> okay, this is cool. Now, I wish you could spray it. I wish that'd be so cool. I remember I was talking to, I think it was Rye the Pop Guy, and he said it'd be really cool if we could get a white version of a janky and have it so this thing actually sprayed, and then we could custom a janky with a cranky. I don't know. It would have been really cool. But yeah, you guys can see here, it does have like that thing on the inside. I don't know what that's even for when you're shaking up a spray paint can, uh, but it is inside of a normal spray paint can and that's supposed to be there as well, guys. The cap does come off like a real spray paint can and you guys can see there, it says 2020 pineapple yellow. This thing is really, really well done. There's just so much detail on this too, guys. And what I think is really funny is they say, do not puncture, incinerate, or store above 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Keep it cool and don't run it, okay? Um, keep out of reach of children. Kids ruin everything. So like it starts off normal and then the ending is kind of like funny. I think that's really neat. Um, avoid open flames. This goes back to the first bullet. Take care of your things. Anyways, this is just really cool that they did this. Um, dries fast to a smooth professional finish. Directions, play or display and enjoy. Figure does not contain paint. I wish it did. I know it doesn't and it, it totally makes sense why it doesn't, but I think it would be really cool if it did. Um, shake well, danger extremely dope, pure collectability. And then you guys can see on the bottom there, it's got the super plastic. And then if I'm not mistaken, that is the artist's signature on the other foot right there. But you guys can kind of see it says super plastic. It's white on white, so it's hard to see, but there is the artist's signature right there. But anyways, yeah guys, this is just such an amazing character. I'm so glad that I could order one of these things because it's way better than I expected. All right, careful, careful, careful. I don't want to ruin it. Got it. All right, guys. Now, last but not least, we have the Funko Pop here. Now, you guys might know what it is by the tape on this box. Well, what happened here is he had put up another one um, on his site, and I wanted to check it out because it's a little bit different from the first one. I do own the other one. They had actually sent it to me to check out early. So, if you guys remember that, I think we were one of five. So, uh, Gabriel Iglesias and his team over there, thank you so much for considering me uh, when sending one over. But yeah, he had done another thing with the same figure, and I wanted to purchase one just because I didn't purchase the first one. So, I thought, why not get this one? I'm trying to circle around what it is if you guys haven't noticed so that way it's a little bit more suspenseful but you guys probably know what it is by now all right guys here it is okay this is sick okay so we'll, yeah okay this is great i can see the other one right over there now this is the gabriel iglesias figure now what i really like about this is that they they put up another one on the site it's the exact same figure but it's signed this time i think he was selling them for forty dollars if i'm not mistaken but you guys can see there this is his signature on the front there i was just so excited to get this one because i am a huge fan of gabriel iglesias so it was cool that they reached out to me so now i actually have one of him signed and one not signed and this is the first ever Pop Comedians, and they actually have a second comedian coming out soon. It's the Jeff Dunham one. Now, it's actually been released on his website, so you can order it now if you guys want to. It's number three in the line, and I think for the second one, it's going to be another Gabriel Iglesias figure, so it'll be cool to see what that one is when it is announced. But yeah, I'm just so excited about this whole Comedians line because there's so much potential with this. And this is a Fluffy Shop exclusive, guys, and if I'm not mistaken, it's still on their site if you guys want to go pick one up now, so I recommend doing it because 40 bucks for a signature, you can't get that when you go to like Comic-Con or something like that. And it's not even just the signature you get the pop as well as the signature it's a pretty great deal well anyways guys hope you guys enjoyed this video and again thank you to youtube for sending these over and again sorry it was so late but at least we got to open them up on the channel and they do look really really great but anyways hope you guys enjoyed and if you guys want to see more from me in the future don't forget to like come subscribe do all that but this has been the episode top pops popsters thanks for watching thanks for watching wait what just happened there hey you made it to the end of the video if you're new around here, you should subscribe to keep up to date with the channel. I do upload every day after all. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you.
and you can always like the video if you know, <laughs> well, liked the video. And if a video every day isn't enough for you, you can always check me out on many other platforms. I do post pretty much every day over there as well. Oh, and I also wanted to mention that due to popular demand, we now have Top Pops merch. Yeah, I know, I know, you're welcome. We have a bunch of different designs and the shirts come in 16 different colors. That's right, 16 different colors. So there's literally a color for everyone. There's also phone cases, sweaters, and since so many of you asked, yes, we finally have wall clocks. I'll have it all linked in the description down below for you guys to check out. Anyways, that's gonna do it for today, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.